Okay, Murray. We need Bob's help to recover the lost components, but he's in terrible condition. It's up to you to get him back into climbing shape. No problem, Bentley. The Murray knows what it takes to be a champion. All right, listen up. Playtime is over. Your job is to get back in shape, and my job is to make that happen. To do that, the Murray is taking your training to the next level. Look around. We'll be using your standard training exercises. Slippery slope, penguin popper, sumo slap, duck and cover, super sling, and whack a choke. Okay, so maybe they're not your standard exercises, but they are Murray approved, so let's get started. Using advanced training techniques, the Murray has gained the balance of a mountain goat. Now I'm gonna pass my secret on to you. It's simple. You stand in the middle of the ice, and my little helpers will shake things up. All you have to do is keep that egg in one piece. <laughs> keep shifting your weight. Like the Murray, you need to develop your reaction speed, and not just at the dinner table. You want to hit your opponent at just the right instant. Time your attack and whack the opponent when he's in front of you. The Murray can hit the bullseye while standing on his head. The key is concentration. So take a good look at those pterodactyls. See the targets they're holding? Put my little pals in that sling and show them how real birds fly. When you hit enough targets, you win. Make those penguins fly. <laughs> Take your time, but not too much time. Concentrate on the targets. A real fighter knows when to strike and when to back off. Like whether or not to have one more pepperoni and chocolate chip burrito. To make these split second calls, you need precision. Our little penguin pals are gonna start popping out of those holes along with some fakes. Just make sure you hit the real birds. <laughs> Yeah! Bad 
During my illustrious sumo career, I developed the strength to move my opponent, no matter how big. I also won the ramen eating championship, but that's another story. To develop this kind of power, you have to push yourself. All right, your opponent is ready. When the two of you meet, you better find your strength. If you don't, he's gonna slap you in the next week. When you can move him out of the ring, you'll be done here. Use your power! Don't let him back you up! Come on, move that big bird! That's using your strength, champ! When you've been fighting as long as the Murray, you develop cat-like reflexes. But like without all the hairballs and stuff. To do this, you have to keep your focus. This exercise is simple. Dodge the penguin. If you can dodge a penguin, you can dodge anything. Figure out where those birds are going, then get out of the way! Good going, Bob! That's how you focus! Bob, you've got what it takes! You earned those medals, but there's one last test. You've got to put it all together! Everything at once! Sort of like a triple-decker pizza! You know what you gotta do! Now make the Murray proud!
Now you're 